Hi, my name is Christopher Borowski. I'm the expert manager for Samash Poland. Today, I would like to talk to you about settings and adjustments on this front-mounted KDF340 mower. Before the first startup of the machine, we need to check the direction of rotation of the tractor front PTO. Mower is set for a clockwise direction of rotation. However, this can be changed by reversing this gearbox. Once the hydraulics is connected, the next step would be mounting a PTO shaft. We need to remember that PTO shaft needs to be cut to the wanted length because lower links of the tractor may vary. Detailed instruction how to cut the PTO you can find in the operations manual. Preparing machine to work, uh, we need to set the headstock at the certain height. Uh, important distance is to keep 30 centimeters, which is about a feet, from this rubber bumper to the frame. Once the headstock is set, then we attached support chains, which will determine the headstock height. That's the transport latch. It needs to be disengaged first. KDF mowers are equipped with two single acting cylinders, which lift the cutting unit when turning on the headland. There is no need of lifting the tractor front link when making a turn on the headland. In KDF 340, a uh, cutting unit is suspended on four coil uh, springs. Ground pressure can be set by retracting or extending the length of this spring bolt. We need to remember about lubrication of the machine. All the grease points are marked with this decal. Power to the cutter bar is transmitted via PTO shafts through those oil operating gearboxes. We have a check plug here. We have a drain plug here and the vent on top. We suggest the first oil change after 50 hours, then after 500 hours or at least once a year. Oil used uh, for those gearboxes is 80 weigh 90. Before the first use of the machine we need to put a protective canvas on. Canvas is fixed with those bolts on top of the frame and buckles from both sides. Protective canvas goes in between the railing here and the front plate here. The that plate protects the canvas to be cut by cut material. Samash front mounted mowers are equipped with the cutting height gauge. Cutting height can be adjusted with this toppling here. KDF mower is equipped with two single acting cylinders which lift the mower when turning on the headland. Swat width can be adjusted by means of those spring-loaded double swat guides. In really heavy crop, we can lift the front guard up in order to increase cutting performance. To reduce transport width, KDF mowers are equipped with foldable side guards. Before starting work, you need to fold them down. Once the machine is set, we can start cutting. We turn the front PTO on 
and we slowly start building up RPMs up to a thousand. Thank you for your attention. Remember that for all the safety issues, always refer to the operator manual.